In this video, we will take a first look at the new PostScope 4 software. The main menu is organized into tabs. Users with high-resolution monitors could find fonts relatively small. You can adjust them by clicking Fonts button under Settings tab. Set them big enough so you can easily read the text. Under Display step, you will find Oscilloscope, XY Scope, Frequency Analyzer, Recorder and the Logic Analyzer buttons. Click on them to open relevant display windows. Align function organizes displays in different alignment configurations. For instance, 2x2. Two You can save the Windows arrangement to file and open it later, so you don't have to arrange the display windows every time you open the software. User interface is currently translated into English, Portuguese, Slovenian and Polish. To efficiently switch to another language, it's advised to restart the software. The About tab consists of News, Updates and the About buttons. The News button tells us all about the latest software improvements. Updates button takes us to the PostScope website, where you can find the latest release of PostScope software and much more. About button shows us the version of PostScope software and all plugins. Device menu buttons will open graphic user interface controls for devices. Here we can find reference output controls, Mega 1 device control knobs and switches, Mega 50 device controls, we will take a closer look at those two in the following videos, and the software analog generator with its knobs. Event Log shows us what's happening with the device. It's a very useful tool for system diagnostics in case something doesn't work the way we expect it. YouTube button will take you to our YouTube channel where you can find other examples of how to use our oscilloscopes and other products. Little Planet Earth picture will take you to our website where you can find other PostScope products software updates and documentation. So will the download button, which is the starting point to upgrade the software free of charge. Last but not least, there is the Devices button, where you can set the number of device instances connected to the PostScope software. We can now close our desktop setting configuration and try to open it from an external file. Device windows automatically open and style themselves in the same way they were before. Let's move on to the next exercise. Thank you for watching.